To build a custom map, it's sometimes quicker to copy one of the sample maps to use as a base. Tap and hold, the file menu appears. For iOS, touch and swipe left, tap copy, and select the destination. This list will show if you have multiple units loaded in the app. Tap OK to get back to the main screen. The copied map is listed without the blue box. If you want to build a map completely from scratch, tap the plus sign on the main screen. A new map entry appears. To edit a map, tap to open the mapping details screen. The name can be edited and notes added. The date a map was loaded into the ECU on the bike will be populated automatically. The three sample maps cannot be edited. The FI and ignition maps are shown at the top of the screen. Tap each one to edit. When you look at the FI and ignition maps, realize that the zeros represent the standard FI and ignition mapping that was programmed at the factory. The power tuner is changing the mapping from the original factory settings at each of the 16 points. For fuel injection, each of the 16 points can be adjusted from plus 7 to minus 7 steps. Tap the throttle RPM point you wish to edit and tap the up control to increase fuel injector duration at that point. Tap the down control to decrease duration. You should tap the point again to unselect it when you have the setting you want. You can select multiple points to move them all up or down together. If you do not unselect a previous point when you're done, it might change when you don't expect it to. Each of these steps represent a 2% change in fuel injection duration time. You can increase duration up to 14% and decrease duration by 14% in 2% steps. Fuel injector duration at each point varies depending on conditions, but for example, if the FI duration at 20% throttle and 5,000 RPM was 5 milliseconds, setting that value point in the power tuner app to plus 3 would increase injector duration by 6%, or 0.3 milliseconds, for a total of 5.3 milliseconds. Increasing the numbers from 0 adds more gasoline at that throttle RPM position point, making the air-fuel ratio richer, like installing bigger jets in a carburetor. Decreasing the numbers makes the air-fuel ratio leaner, like putting smaller jets in a carburetor. Leaner air-fuel ratios creates more engine heat, which could lead to engine overheating or damage if the setting is too lean for the operating conditions or engine load. The ignition timing can be advanced up to 4 degrees or retarded by 9 degrees at each of the 16 adjustment points. These numbers are the actual changes to the base ignition timing at that throttle and RPM setting. For example, let's say the ignition timing at 5,000 RPM and 20% throttle opening was 12 degrees before top dead center. If we change the edit point to plus 2, the ignition timing would be 14 degrees before top dead center. Setting that point to minus 2 would retard the timing to 10 degrees before top dead center. Advanced ignition timing also creates more engine heat. Engine overheating or damage could result if the ignition timing is advanced too far for the operating conditions or engine load. The default position points for both fuel injection and ignition maps are 20, 40, 60, and 80 percent for throttle opening, and the engine speed points are 2,000, 5,000, 8,000, and 10,000 RPM. The Power Tuner app also allows you to edit these default position points to give you a tremendous amount of adjustability. Tap the position tab, then tap the throttle or RPM setting you wish to change. Tap the up or down control to move that range of position points. For example, if you select the 40% throttle setting, moving the position up or down will move that setting for all four of the RPM position points. The position setting range for throttle opening is closed throttle to full open. The engine RPM setting range is 0 to 12,000 RPM. Now this does not change the RPM limiter map that is built into the ECU. Setting the RPM position range in the power tuner app to 12,000 does not mean the engine will rev to 12,000 RPM. The stock rev limiter will still control the maximum RPM of the engine.